right, ladies and gentlemen, we are ready for the next bout of the evening. Please welcome our first warrior into the cage, fighting out of the blue corner. Give it up for Franz Malambo. Ladies and gentlemen, let's welcome his opponent into the cage. Fighting out of the blue corner. Put your hands together. for Brave Combat Federation Brave 10. Introducing your first warrior, fighting out of the blue corner. This man's a mixed martial artist with a professional record of four wins and two losses. He stands 175 centimeters tall and weighs already 61.05 kilograms. Representing SPG Ireland out of Dublin, Ireland by way of South Africa. Give it up for the Black Mamba, Franz Malambo! And his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, this man's a mixed martial artist with a professional record of 12 wins and two losses and won no contest. He stands 170.18 centimeters tall and weighs already 61.1 kilograms. Representing Shootbox, Diego Lima, and fighting out of Sao Paulo, Brazil. Give it up for Felipe Efrain. Your referee is Fernand Basul. And Ferdy Bassan will be your referee. Felipe Efrain taking on the Black Mamba, Franz Malambo. As you see the Black Mamba loosening up, getting those arms ready, getting those hands ready. It's what he does best. We'll see if he can use that reach. He has a big reach advantage here, Carrick. If he can use it and not allow Efrain to close that distance, it can make a big difference in this fight. Efrain won his last three fights inside the distance with only one of them making it into the second round. I don't think there's going to be a very long feeling out period here. It's Efrain in the white, it's Malambo in the red. That Diego Lima shoot box crew out of Sao Paulo. So many great fighters have come out of there. And 
I mean, when you have literally, I mean, Shootbox Diego Lima taking on SBG Ireland. You talk about two really top-tier camps going at each other here. A lot of people feel Shute Box has the most distinguished tradition in the entire history of the sport. And I think I probably agree with you on that. John Cavanaugh maybe building the next one. Francis trying to establish that jab, but without putting himself in any danger. Nice right lead. Beautiful jab. Efrain, though, keeping him up against the cage. Beautiful jab once again there by Malambo. Malambo's got to be happy with how many of these blows are landing. He may start to set down a little bit more. Throwing here in Amon Jordan. Getting it done. Malambo's landed a good 10 shots so far. I think you're going to try and keep him, see him distance manage and pot shot from the outside until he slowed his opponent down. So far, this is everything Malambo expected or wanted. Lombo doing a great job, though, just circling it and just landing the jab, doing what he should do. Ephraim, though, you know, Ephraim, it's just at any moment he can hit that knockout blow, whether it's a big flying knee. If he finds an opening, he can just really go to work. And the Lombo lands it. My goodness, the Lombo. And it's over! Oh my goodness! Raz Malambo just beat Felipe Efrain! The Black Mamba just punched his ticket for a title fight. We're gonna take a look now at the precision perfect striking of Franz Malambo, not to mention his beautiful footwork, not to mention his beautiful kicks. This was a picture perfect fight from one of the next big stars in this sport. You can see the blows landing over and over. There was the big one. It lands again in the interest of fighter safety. The referee jumps in and stops it. Let's throw it back up to Carlos Kramer. All right, ladies and gentlemen, this bout comes to an end at two minutes and 52 seconds of the very first round. Referee, Ferdinand Massoon stops the bout for your winner by TKO due to strikes out of SBG Ireland, the Black Mamba, Franz Malambo.